I am back with another video today. In today's video, I'm going to be reviewing the new Maybelline Dream Cushion Foundation. So yeah, if you want to see what I think of this, please keep watching. So I'm just applying my Dr. Brandt Pores No More Primer. We're going to pat it. Nice. I'm gonna pad some more. The color's pretty good. Thankfully, the color is good. The color I got it in was um, classic ivory. It's nice. I don't know how I if I really like this sponge that it comes. I feel like really just moving everything around rather than blending it in. Very buildable if you want more of a full coverage. Try not to put too much foundation underneath my eyes since I will be going in with some concealer. So yeah, I'm not really a big fan of the tool it comes with. Just dab it because it really does pick up a lot of product. Oh yeah, that's better. tell the difference between this side and then this side. That is the foundation on. I really apply a lot underneath my eyes of foundation since I will be going in with concealer. That is the foundation. I think it's really pretty. You know, maybe I'll go in with some concealer on camera. So I put this part on fast speed since this was mainly about the foundation. finished my bronzer, my lipstick, and yeah, so what I think about this bad boy. I honestly really like it. I think I paid $12.99, I got it at Harman's. I think it's really buildable, very light. I really don't feel anything heavy on my face. I hate when I, I feel the makeup, like I go like this, you know? But yeah, I really like this foundation. I think I'll definitely be wearing it a lot, especially since I don't like using my high-end foundations on an everyday basis since they are so pricey this at any local drugstore. I really build it to full coverage. Mm -hmm. If you were interested in it, you should definitely pick it up. It's 111 and we're gonna give updates on the foundation. I'll be back. Pretty good. I feel like it's kind of breaking up a little. I feel a little oily already. I'm gonna put some powder on. Maybe I won't touch up actually. I'll wait till later. I'm running out again real quick and I'll come back. All right, so I'm back. As you can see, I'm a little oily. The lighting's not as good because now it's nighttime. A little darker. I usually use natural sunlight, so it's maybe a little hard to see. Um, I think it stuck really well. A little oily in my T-zone, but that's normal. Normal on my skin. Going with a little powder. That, I really like the foundation. I think it cheap, super thin. I think it goes on so nicely if you're not even wearing foundation. So yeah, this is me adding powder to my T-zone. Just a little powder. I think 
it came out really nicely. This is a go-to. Thank you.